Hello students, once again welcome to Bhola Nath Academy. Today students, we are going to see the new topic that is very interesting topic students that is called as Organo Metallic Chemistry. This is the part of the chemistry students. Here we are using Organo as well as what metals and it is forming chemistry. So we, we call it as Organo Metallic Chemistry. In Organo Metallic Chemistry students, the chemistry which deals with the organometallic compound is called as organometallic chemistry now what is organometallic compound students the organometallic compounds are the therefore defined as a compound in which metal atom are non metals like boron silicon arsenic phosphorus etc are bonded directly to the carbon atom of of at least one organic group radicals or it may be molecules understanding students so this type of compounds are called as organometallic compounds understanding students so you have to start the definition from here compound in which metal atom are non-metal like boron silicon arsenic or phosphorus extra are bonded directly to the carbon atom of at least one organic group or radical or molecules understanding students here we have shown students some examples of organometallic compound first example students here is tetraethyl platinum now platinum will be metals and ethyl is what organic compound you know students that is why it is called as what organometallic compound here also students you can see in ferrocene this is the organic moiety and this is what iron is a metal so it is forming ferrocene as a compound this is also a well known organometallic compound now we have seen trimethyl or orthoborate so these are the organometallic compound students now students we are going to see the ligand haptacity what is ligand haptacity students in organometallic compounds one or more organic group are linked now students we are here we are talking about organic group are linked to the metal the number of carbon atom now students here it is very important number of carbon atom of the ligand linked to the metal differ from ligand to ligand this is known as ligand haptacity understand students so you have the organic group students now how many number of carbons are going to be linked with the metal that is called as ligand haptacity now it is expressed as eta raised to x where x is the number of carbon atom of the ligand understand students now students we are going to see that are linked to the metal in the compound understanding now haptacity indicate the number of carbon atom of organic moiety which are within the bonding distance of the metal so this way also you can explain the haptacity the following table tabular form shows the more example students now we are going to see different different types of ligand now here we are going to see students haptacity which ligand we call as mono hapto ligands now here students we have given the example alkyl now this is the structure of alkyl cs3 now number of carbon atom which are bonded to the metal is only one that is why it is called as mono hapto ligand which we are showing with eta raised to one understand students now second students which ligand we call as dihapto ligand this is the symbol of dihapto ligand students di means two and hapto means this is the eta symbol understanding so we read as what dihapto ligand the example is students ligand is alkene is coming formula is c2h4 understanding this is this ligand is what dihapto ligand when you see the structure students the carbon carbon there will be double bond understanding so both the carbons are involved in the bonding with the metal that is why it is called as what dihapto ligand now comes to the third students that is called as trihapto ligand it is a why it is called as trihapto ligand because here students three carbons are involved in the bonding with the metal understanding students the very well uh, famous example is students pi allyl the formula is c3h5 this is the structure formula students now number of carbon which are bonded to the metal students they are three that is why it is called as what trihapto ligand now comes to the students fourth type of ligand that is called as tetrahapto ligand now here students when you see eta is what called as hapto and here four is there that is why it is called as tetrahapto ligand the well known example is students butadiene the formula is c4h6 butadiene is students here it is made up of four carbon all the four carbons are involved in the bonding with the metal that is why it is called as tetrahapto ligand understanding students why we call it tetrahapto all the four carbon atoms are linked to the metal now coming down to the fifth type that is called as pentahapto ligand students here also students why we call it penta students because here number of carbon atom which are bonded to the metal is 5 that is why it is called as what pentahapto ligand the number of carbon is what 5 now students well known example is cyclopentadiene the formula is c5h5 so these are the example students very well example you should know for the examination point of view now one more example students that is called as hexahapto ligand understanding students so ligand is very well important ligand is benzene the formula is c6s6 this is the structure now all the six carbons are bonded with the metal that is why it is called as hectahapto ligand students 
हेक्सा हेक्टो लेगेंड अंडरस्टैंडिंग स्टूडेंट्स सो दीज आर द टाइप्स ऑफ लेगेंड वी हैव सीन डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द नंबर ऑफ कार्बन विच आर बॉन्डेड टू द मेटल दीज आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द एग्जामिनेशन पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू स्टूडेंट्स इफ यू लाइक माई वीडियो प्लीज शेयर इट सब्सक्राइब इट थैंक यू थैंक य